Hi folks, Steve Capozzi in Thailand. I've been out today at the farm in the mountains um, collecting date palms. And you can see those videos elsewhere um, under my playlist, The Farm. Um, we collected um, date palms. But while I was out there um, doing that, I came across, just by chance, a couple of real life birds nests. And here they are. I just put these into my backpack, which is full of... I've got to clean this back bag out now. I came across these bird's nests. There's the chickens there. And they're real life, I'm getting close here. And you can see these are real life bird's nests. But why, why these are good to collect is they make great fire um, tinder. Basically it's a bird's nest, it's a tinder bundle. It's a great way to make fire. Now a real life, what, when you make a fire, say with sparks or a piece of charcoal, the best way is to collect, obviously, um, very fine material, which will start to burn very easily. But, there's a chicken again. Birds, when they make a nest, they're actually the best at making these sorts of, well, a bird's nest. I mean, a bird's nest is perfect for what I'm talking about, for making a fire. Uh, birds just collect the most, you know, the very fine grass, um, leaves, and, a, bird, a bird's nest, in effect, just becomes, by definition, the best way to start a fire. That's a bird's nest. It's a real life bird's nest that fell out of a tree. I picked up two today. And you look at this bird's nest here, I mean, this thing is just incredible. It's dry. It hasn't rained. It, it rained a bit today, but not much. And what you can do is, if you have an ember, embers from in a char cloth, piece of steel wool. You can put the ember in there if you make a primitive fire with a bow drill. Um, you can put the ember in there, close it up, blow on that thing until it catches on fire. And the bird's nest is just very fine material, very fine grass, small twigs and so forth. And that thing is just the best tinder to make a fire. When we talk about tinder, that's tinder material. And there's two birds nest I found today at the farm. And they are just absolutely perfect for making fires. So I just wanted to show you this bit of a, um, a tip trick um, for camping and so forth if, if you want to practice bushcraft. Now you can make fires any way you like. Lighters, um, you can buy those barbecue fuel um, starters, fire starters, barbecue starters. Um, rubber tires, rings of rubber, the inner tube of rubber, um, you know, uh, cotton balls, sparks and cotton, cotton balls, cotton balls soaked in Vaseline. There's many ways of, uh, to have, you know, man-made or unnatural um, timber material. Um, but this is like a natural tinder, bird's nests. And as you're camping, as you're walking around, you need to look around the landscape and find things. You just don't walk through like a hero um, marching through the forest or the bush or wherever you are. You need to look around, pick up materials, resources that you can use when you're camping, bushcrafting, whatever you're doing out there in the, um, in the wilderness, in the bush. And finding this sort of tinder material, real <coughs> bird's nests, actually real life bird's nests, is an example of finding resources as you walk through the bush. And there you are. What you want to do is save that. Um, you can save it in a plastic bag, keep it dry, put that in your pack and keep going. You don't have to use it straight away. Um, basically, you're going to find it as you walk through the day. You pack it away, plastic bag, keep it dry just in case it rains. And when you make a camp, you can just break it out and make a fire. I've got two here. Now, I can break this into two or three pieces, two, three, four, five pieces, depending on how I make the fire how much um, um, artificial tinder I use, a lighter, um, you can use a fire steel, cotton balls, you name it. I'd say one cotton ball, one scrape of a fire steel in that, and you've got yourself a fire. You have your um, kindling, your larger sticks ready to put on top, and there you are. Two real life bird's nests, great fire making resources that you need to find when you're out in the bush.
Okay, so just a quick um, video here about birds' nests. Um, yep, I'll see you for the next video. Thank you.